take a look at John Gray's numbers so far this season through his four starts he is 0 and 1 with 5.5 1 ERA you can see good strikeouts 15 of those so far he has allowed a couple of home runs a strikeout rate of 22 percent for John Gray. He's, he's been a real spark for this team maybe the spark they really needed but their strike three called and John Gray that is a huge shutdown inning a one two three effort. Oh there's a strike called on Otani. And there are two away in the third. That is a beauty from John Gray. And he strikes out Rendon. Back to back K's for John Gray in a scoreless third. 2 2. A swing and a miss. He strikes out Otani. Been around and do the hokey pokey. That's what it's all about, Dave. <laughs> With the long hold and the 1 2 pitch. Here's a swing and a miss. He strikes out Romine, his eighth punch out of the night. 2 1. And this one out to center field. That drops in for a hit. So two outs, couple of men on, and John Gray's evening is done. Chris Woodward takes the ball, but a nice job from the Rangers right-hander tonight. And his first pitch, Seager rips that one into right field, base hit. White has great speed, they'll send him. No throw offered, headed to third base, Simeon. Seager drives in the first Rangers run. Ooh, that ball hit well. Deep out to center field, long run for Trout, and that one will bang off the fence. Simeon is in, Seager to third, and a booming double by Adolis Garcia. And man, is that exciting. And another changeup here. This one not as high as the one that he threw to Seager. A respectable changeup, but you talked about him letting it fly. It's his ball in the air, deep to center field. Trout will have room, but it'll be deep enough to tie the game. Well, hard smash, pass first, into right, Rangers on top. Heim just blasted that one into right field, and it's 4-3 Rangers. Well, this ball was hit hard, but it looked like it was right at Walls. Now, you have the artificial surface here, so the ball's going to get on you pretty quick. The 1-2. And that one out to left field, drops in, base hit. That could get two runs to the plate. Here comes the throw. It's not in time. And the Rangers have doubled up the Angels in this first inning. This ball pretty well center field. Trout chased back to the wall. Leaps. It is gone. Jonah Heim knocks it out. Right on time for Jonah Heim. Fastball. Not a bad one at all. 95 miles an hour located down and away. And Mike Trout thought he had a real chance to catch this ball. His expression afterwards of real frustration. He got to the wall. You see him spin two different times. He was close. He just missed it. See, and it's like you're still a little kid. They're all little kids. <laughs> Even Mike Trout slams his glove. This one lined out to center field, and what a catch by Obombe! Somewhere between a dive and a shoestring grab. Maybe a little gymnast in there to make that play. That's the thing of beauty. We know some of the low line drives for Garcia have given him some trouble that have gone over his head. This one he's got to come in and get and takes it right off the turf. I mean, it's basically like the last eight innings took potentially here about 2.15. This ball out towards center field. On comes Garcia and he makes another fantastic shoestring grab. And that's 